how do you find the energy density stored in the magnetic field? You use an inductor. So an inductor is a coil of wire. We can calculate the magnetic field. It depends on the number of turns, the current, and the length. Also, if you change the current, then you get a voltage across that. But if you know the current and the voltage, then you know the power, and the power is the rate of change of energy. So here we can write the voltage, the EMF, as the inductance, which depends on that stuff right there, times the derivative of the current with respect to time, and I can write power as I times that, and so I get the power is the rate of change of energy. Now I can multiply both sides by dt and integrate both sides. I get the change in energy, the delta, the dt's cancel, yay, and I can integrate and I get one half IL squared. Then if I go and divide by the volume, which is A times D, and then convert it back from the inductance, I get one half mu B squared. Energy density.